Hey everyone, so it's Ruben Lollipop here, and I am your Wednesday for Crafty Goma. So today, um, since this week theme is Real Akuma, I decided to make this adorable uh, Real Akuma um, honey bread charm. And it's just a bottle cap. So yeah, and if you want to make it uh, into a keychain, you guys can just poke a hole and just add, you know, a ball chain or a cell phone strap. So it looks like that. And I'm going to be teaching you guys how to make this um, picture, but you can, of course, use any other picture that you want. And if you don't want to draw it out, you can, of course, use printed pictures or stickers. So let's just get started with the materials. So you're going to be needing a, a black marker or a black pen. I'm using this Sharpie, but you can, of course, use any other black marker that you would like to use. You're going to be needing a pair of scissors or a hobby knife. You're going to be needing um, white glue or Mod Podge Dimensional Magic. They both work the same way. And um, white glue dries transparent. So yeah. You're going to be needing some scrap up paper or just some normal paper. And you're going to be needing pencil if you're drawing. And if you're drawing, again, um, you guys can use um, crayons or pastels. I'm using these oil pastels that I have on me because I think that um, it's just really um, bold the color so let's just get started with the tutorial so what you want to do first is to get your bottle cap and what you want to do is to get an, a clean spot on the paper like preferably at the side because then you don't have to cut so much and I don't know if you can see that and what you want to do is to just trace around so this is just, you know, like a space that you have to draw your image in. So yeah, and once you've done with that, we're going to be drawing your picture in. Since this week is Real Akuma theme, I'm going to be drawing a Real Akuma inside. So I have done drawing, coloring, and outlining it, and I lost footage of all of them, so I'm so sorry about that. But um, it just looks like that. It's really pretty, I guess. I messed up on the face and don't worry about this line here. So yeah, and now we're going to be using a pair of scissors to cut it out. So yeah, and um it's not a need to color it all perfectly. You can since we are using um oil pastels here, um it can go a little bit out of line because the side is blunt, but I'm not sure if you use chalk pastels. Chalk pastels have a sharp edge because they are um, square, so I'm not sure about that because my chalk pastels are from Daiso and I um, I ran out of them, so I have to go get new ones. But um, now it's like I have to study and stuff, so I can't go out. So I've done cutting it out and it looks something like this. So yeah. And now what you want to do is to get your bottle cap and see if it fits. And you want to fit it all the way in. So like mine, if you see that it can't fit, you want to trim it a bit. So I'll tell you I will show you guys when it is done. So once you've got your picture um perfect cut and trimmed in size um, you can get your butter cap and you're going to place it into check again and get your um, up hodge dimensional magic or white glue and paste it down and if you put too much white glue like I did it might rip a little bit and if you're using this type of bottle caps you're gonna have your this is when the cotton bud comes in and you want to gently pat it so yeah and mine ripped a little. I don't know if you can see, but yeah. So once you're done with that, we're going to be um getting an, a layer of it. Okay, hold on. Wait. Um, we're going to get a layer of it. See, I changed the the tip so that it looks like that. <laughs> Get a little bit. Oops, I put too much. Oopsie. 
and now get in your cotton bud and you want to just spread everything out you want to put a thin layer because um it will take lesser time to dry up if it's a thin layer and spread everything out and it looks really silly right now because it's all cloudy um but it will dry clear so another method if you don't have white glue or um the Mod Podge Dimensional Magic is to get epoxy stickers like they're just resin that's already made for you and it's a sticker so yeah and you can just paste it on and you don't need to watch this step so yeah it looks really silly right now because it's all cloudy but after um, a few hours it will dry clear so yeah so I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial on how to make this bottle cap and the finished product should look something like this. As you can see, it is shiny after it is dried and mine has a rip over there because I pressed it too much and yeah. So this is how you make it. So yeah, bye!